um, this is not the best quality camera that I'm using. I'm using this video camera one. Obviously it looks bright because I've got, I'm using my LED light. Because when we go over there, it's going to be really dark. Because the light's all the way over there. So, yeah. so I need this on. And I can't turn it on and off during the video. Which is pretty annoying, but yeah. So yeah, this it might not be the best quality. But with the light, it's not too bad, to be honest with you. It's better. So yeah. And obviously I've just charged up my phone, so I'm not worrying about the battery. Um, I did make up a video last night, but I decided not to upload it. I don't think I uploaded it anyway. But it was basically a shout out to another subscriber. Um, but obviously they made it private. So, I couldn't see who it was. But they commented and stuff. And so yeah, I'm going to give them a shout out. I will show the channel in the next video when I have my laptop, but I don't have it at the moment. But I'm just going to give her a shout out anyway. Oh, what's this? It is an orange. Wow. I'll just put that there. Anyway, um, and the channel's called Ratty, Ratty, Ratty for, is, it's R-A-T-T-I-E, R-A-T-T-Y, that's basically how you spell it, in case you're just wondering. I'll probably have it in the description bar, but if I don't, I will definitely do another shout out for all you guys. And I'll probably just do another shout out altogether, <laughs> just because I've now got seven subscribers, which I'm really happy about. Um, Peach Pet Paradise, you should still go and subscribe to her. Amazing channel, amazing person. Oh, she's just so kind and so nice, and she's so popular. I'm surprised she even wants to speak to me, so I'm just so happy about that. But yeah, anyway, I'm going to start now because I've been speaking for quite a bit. Um, I don't think I've done a room tour. Well, I hope I haven't. I can't remember what videos I've done, to be honest with you. But yeah, I don't think I've done a room tour. So this video is a room tour, as you can probably guess by the name. But yeah. Um, so I'm just going to try and make this not that bad, but yeah. Not that bad, I mean, like, not that long. But I'll try my best. Right. So. Come out here. You have the whole light. Which makes it very nice. But yeah. And then... We have a bedroom sign, which is always very nice, and we have the door. So yeah, we're going to go ahead and get started. So then you come in, and there's loads of goats on the back. Obviously I share this bedroom, so yeah, it's going to be quite uh, messy, and not everything's mine. This is my light, where you can twizzle it on and off, so that's always good. There we have some like wall stickers, and they are, sorry about the light. They're like flowery things. Which is really good. So yeah. I'm sure in my last video I could turn it on and off, but not sure what I done. Anyway. Um so here we just have a load of random stuff where we don't know where to put it. This is an old remote. We don't even have this for the TV anymore. So yeah, that's very pointless, but I guess we ain't got Let's give rid of it. We are supposed to be having a car boot sale soon, but we say that every year and we never do. <laughs> this is my sister's DS. This is this thing that I got ages ago, and it's really cute, and we kept it. Just really cute and fluffy. <laughs> this I made, like, in year seven or something. I don't know what that is in American year, sorry. But, yeah. It's just the start of going to... I think it's high school. <laughs> or secondary school. Um, this is like <laughs> I think I made. I'm really proud about it, but it could do with some more gluing. And I didn't finish it, obviously, or else I would have painted. Here we have an Egyptian mummy. I think you can guess where this is from. It's got a mummy in it, so that's always good. This is our DVD remote. Soon we're getting a new TV, so yeah, these are dead old remotes and stuff. Then we have like a load of stuff for the hamsters and stuff show that in another video if I haven't already. Then, I don't know why this is here, but yeah, it should be over there. Um, we have the One Direction, sorry about the light, uh, I really can't help it, Midnight Memories, oh there we go. So I got this for Christmas, and you didn't see it in my Christmas haul because, um, not Christmas haul, but yeah, um, because it was up here, so yeah, I can show you it. 
and it has lots of different songs on it and I haven't really listened to it to be honest with you because I've not been up here that much but I'll start listening to that it's my birthday soon like two weeks and five days or something like that well it's on Wednesday um, not this Wednesday it's like two three weeks away then we have loads of random DVDs so yeah I'm not going to show you them all because I haven't got time then we have a set of drawers. I'm going to go through these fairly quickly. Don't know how many times I've tried doing this and I'm like, no, I'm doing it again. <laughs> right, so in here, this is like an art crafty drawer because we've got, well, they're random, to be honest with you. Crafty papers, games we've made. I'm quite impressed with that, actually. Um, blue all that kind of stuff and paper so it's really art crafty and in this bag it's like kind of like I can't really get them out basically I just pull one out there's loads of like Easter stuff because we used to have to make Easter bonnets in like primary school and yeah we got little chicks which are really cute but yeah there's like stuff like that in there I don't really know where we got like half of this stuff from so sorry about that but these are just stuff that we've got years and years. Then in this folder, these need to go in it. But this, I know where I got this from. I got this from, um, du no, not WH, Wilkinson's in my local town. And yeah, it looks really nice. And it was only something like, one ninety nine or two ninety nine, can't remember which one. But it's just really pretty and like vintage style, so it's my style. And I just it just stood out and I was like, oh, for that price, I need a folder anyway to put a load of random stuff in, so I thought that would be a good one to get. But yeah, that needs to go in there. I'll show you all that like that in like another video probably. But yeah. Um, I have had a few questions and I'm going to answer them at the end. So yeah. Um, anyway, I keep saying so. Yeah, this is for like a little light thing we have. It's like a lantern. Yeah. There's stickers and um, crafty stuff again. <laughs> it's good music. I got this from a friend ages ago, and I've just kept it because it's really cute. This I got given from a friend. I really need to give her it back to be honest with you. I don't want to keep it. But she always made me take it to school because we have to keep something. And it has a label on the back, so I know where it got it from. Got it from Sainsbury's. A tropical blue folio case with elastic. I found that really cool. Um, as you can probably tell from all my videos, I love planning. So I have my life plan book. I don't really use this anymore because I like to use PowerPoints now. But it's always good now and again if I can't get access to the computer or something, then it's always handy to, um, think of, this was like two years ago now, so like obviously that's changed, but you know, I've done it all in pencil, so I can always rub it out and stuff, backyard items, that's not really changed, uh, what else have I got, living room items, that's a plan of my own living room. <laughs> I was actually really impressed by that drawing because I'm really bad at drawing, so I was really happy about that. Then at the back, we've got my dog stuff. I can't find it. Oh, there we go. Uh, it's like all whoa, dog stuff. But my plans always change. That's why I don't really like writing them down. Whereas if you do it on PowerPoint, um, you can easily uh, change it. But on here, you'd have to either rub it out or cross it out. So yeah, it takes a long time to do this, while, rather than, compared to if you do it on the computer, you can just copy and paste. So that's why I don't really use this anymore. But I guess I could just start using it to put like stickers and pictures and stuff in. Also got some books. These are two of my favourite books. One of them is called Goodnight Mr Tom. And even though it looks really kiddie-ish or whatever you want to call it, it's a great book and... It was £7. I absolutely love it. You can probably get these online cheaper. 
but it's just a great book about like war and stuff because as you can see on the back it says a sad deprived child be slowly begins to flourish under the care of old tom oakley tom oakley used to be dead grumpy to children and stuff but he looked after him but his new found happiness is shattered by a summons of his mother back in london so yeah he's like one of those like world war people that got evacuated to the uh countryside and he got with a grumpy man but eventually they became like proper good friends and stuff so yeah i definitely recommend that book another one i got this for free but it from like school but this was six pounds And it says, the name of this book is Secret, so obviously that's the title. It was a New York Times bestseller. And, like, I really like it because, like, I'll just, like, say, do a bit. And it says, it has, like, it's just really good. It is quite kiddie-ish, to be honest with you. But it says, warning, do not read this page beyond. And then it says like that. And it says... It's just really good, and you can pause if you want to read some of it. And then it says, Now I can think of worse. Knowing a secret, read on if you must. But remember, I warned you. And it's just dead exciting and really interesting. Then it has, like, all these X's, so you can't read it, obviously. Then it goes, An apology if you're wondering is not a variety of insect, neither is it a typical disease. Wait. I was like, sorry, I couldn't let you read chapter one. That was where you would have learnt the names of the characters in the story. You also would have learnt where it takes place and when. You would have learned all the things you usually learn at the beginning of the book. Unfortunately, I can't tell you any of those things. So it's just a really intriguing book. I've never actually finished it, so I don't know what happens in the end. I've only read a, fair, read a couple of pages because... I don't have time for reading. And we got way with Molly's books. But yeah, I'm just going to hurry it up because I'm aware this video is already really long. And if it gets any longer, it won't be able to upload. Whoa, he almost dropped the thing. Then we have teddies and cats, which are really cute that we got from our friends. So we just keep them. We can't really use them or anything, but we keep them. Then we have my sister's drawer. We have our in crafty stuff. This is really nice, but I've never used it. It's glitter tattoos, skin art. So yeah, I've got more paper, pictures, uh, more books, and pencil cases and stuff. And my pencils that I bought the other day also. So yeah, that's basically that. Then we have some One Direction pictures. I'm not going to go through it because, sorry if I'm rushing, but I need to get this video done. And I've got my guitar. And this is like a rocking horse that we don't use anymore. And it's got clothes all over it and got clothes on the floor. And this is a piano chords book. And here is a cute little teddy. No banish. Uh, the official One Direction scrapbook. And it's got loads of facts and stuff about them. And it's just amazing. It's got lots of pictures in it. And this is my keyboard with my headphones that I was looking for. So I found them. And a kid's... Book. We also have other ones, but they're downstairs on our piano. These are just like quite simple ones, so I can learn how to properly play it because I don't properly play it. If you get what I mean, yeah. Then we had our like wardrobe things. You may have like seen a capture of my face, but I'm not that bothered to be honest with you. Um. Then we have Barbie dolls. I don't know why, but we do. We have our curtains with like stick on clip on butterflies. They were like initially just like eh. I cannot put it back on, so I'll sit there. And then we have my sister's bed, my bed, and beds pull out, so that's always handy. I've got Stunning by uh, Katie Price that's got like stuff in it. <laughs> got pipe cleaners, body sprays, teddies, perfumes. TV, PlayStation 2, and it's really old, but still. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. Much it. My next video, I'll just give you an update on the actual, like, hamster and when I'm getting the items and stuff, because I have good questions on that. So, I'll see you later. Thank you for watching. Give this video a thumbs up, and bye-bye.